down heavy attack tonight. Credit to Larkin's striking ability tonight, or to the way that the Romero fight ended. Um, early on, I guess I definitely have to credit Lorenz Larkin for his, uh, his his good striking. You know, he was throwing a lot. I saw a lot. Of, I saw a lot of his stuff coming, but uh, he was getting through a little bit. So I was like, okay, let me let me put him on the ground, kind of like when I fought Chris Lieberman, just beat him up a little bit, and then we'll see where the striking at in the later rounds. And then um, he came out attacking, and I saw him lunging a lot. So I was like, okay, when he lunges hard at me one time, he's gonna slip up and get a takedown. And then, you know, I just wanted to really work. So I've been working a lot on the ground, you know, working for submissions. So um, I had a couple, I was looking for a Doris at one time. I think I was looking for an Americana, you know, but yeah, he definitely had it. And, and the Romero fight came into factor in the third round. I was almost talking to myself like, you know, come on, we're not going to do this again, you know, uh, dominating the first two rounds. And in the Romero fight, it was more of a stand up, you know, I was out striking him. But still, in the third round, it just kind of like gave it away. So I just gave him a you know, mentally, after the Romero fight, was it hard for you to recover from the fact that you might get hit again, might get knocked out again? Was that a mental hurdle you had to overcome? Um, it wasn't a mental hurdle. It's just, you know, like I said, my last fight in January, I broke my jaw. So, you know, sitting up in the hospital a couple of days, you know, definitely, you know, have you thinking about it. Hey, I don't want to do this again. You know, I want to, you know, just, you know, just, just keep getting better and, and uh, perform better each and every time. You talk about having two daughters. What do they think seeing dad had laid up in the hospital with a broken jaw? Ah, uh, they wanted to come visit. I was in Atlanta and they, um, they live in North Carolina, so uh, they were wanting to come up and visit. And my parents and I was like, no, 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 pause, pause. Like nobody come visit. Let me just you know sit here and watch TV and relax. And I don't want you know I don't need you know I don't I don't want my little girls to see me you know all beat up. So. Um, yeah, that was tough. That was tough, you know. And and they watched the fights, and you know they're excited about it. And they they definitely support him. They always say, you know, my dad lost the last fight, but he always wins. So you know he'll do better next time, like something like that. So it's definitely encouraging. I got a little picture of them. They had they made a little sign for me before the fight. So you know, just gotta get it done. You know, just gotta get it done.